Hey guys, it's Hector here with another kind of a vlog video. And of course this is not important. It's kind of a whiny video, I guess. It's just some of the, something that's been on my mind for a while. Um, you know, there's a, a bunch of people saying a bunch of different things and they're always kind of combining and clashing and whatnot. At least in the United States. I'm sure it's like this all, all around the world. But recently, there's been a lot more people saying that people are getting too too sensitive and overly sensitive. And yeah, that can be true in some aspects. And But actually, this has kind of been going on for a while in this particular subject. People are saying things like, um, you're not special. You're not, you know, an individual basically or... And saying stuff like, you know, um, nobody's going to pat you on the back all ar along the way throughout your life. Life is hard and stuff. Of course, life is definitely hard. But I just want to say that if you keep contributing to this kind of shit and just being a dick about it, then yeah, life is going to be more, you know, hard, I guess. People are going to be more assholes because you're contributing to the assholosity or whatever. And if people are just a little bit more nicer, then life can be a little bit more nicer. And if you actually do give thanks or appreciation to people that you work with or what whatnot, of course, not everybody's going to do that. But that time that you do do it, it'll mean a lot to that person. And then, of course, when other people do it back, then it usually means a lot to you. So of course, you're not always going to get pat on the back for everything. But when you do, it is still nice. And then on, the, on that whole subject of you're not special, I do follow this dude on YouTube who um, does a bunch of different vlogging videos. He lives in Japan. He can be cool sometimes, and then other times he can just be a massive dick. And a lot of times he answers people's questions about Japan because he lives in Japan. Some people want to know how it is in Japan and all that stuff. And um, people usually want to know, well, what's it like being Mexican in Japan? What's it like being gay in Japan, etc., etc. And a lot of times he goes... You know, you're just not that special. You're not a, you know, individual snowflake or whatever. And that's just a kind of a dick thing to say. Yeah, we are all humans. We all laugh and cry and shit and eat and stuff like that. But we are still individuals. We all still have things that make us different from each other. They could be good things. They could be bad things. It could be, you know, some people have anxiety and depression. Some people are always happy or what not there's there's just a bunch of different things that do make us individual but of course we still are human but there are still things that make us unique and i think saying you're not special is like i like i keep saying that's just a dick thing to say you know and it also just kind of puts a blanket over why people hate a lot of people just hate on other people because they don't understand the differences and, well, of course, they also don't understand the similarities of how we're all not special or how we're all, you know, human in that, in that term or realm of that we are not special. Like I keep saying, it is, it's a bit complex. We aren't all special in terms that we are all humans and we all laugh, we all cry, we all love, we all die. That's kind of poetic, I guess. Um... We are all the same in that terms, but we are still different in other terms. And sometimes those differences that people do recognize is what makes other people scared and hateful. And we do need to recognize those differences. We can't just say we're all the same. And if you're not really the same as us, then you're different. And that's not cool or that's weird or whatever. That's not cool either. So... I'm probably not explaining this that well, but I hope you guys can understand that we are all the same, that we are all human, but we are all different. And that is okay that we are all different. And you shouldn't be afraid to say that we're all different. And we shouldn't be afraid to basically be kind because people, at least in the United States, I don't know about some of these other countries, people are getting more and more hateful and more dickish and just... People are like, yeah, I'm an asshole. Yeah, I'm a bitch. I'm okay with that. And that's why, basically, why I don't want to date anyone in the United States anymore. Everybody that I meet is a complete asshole, and it just turns me off. And that's also why, that's why I've been looking for foreigners to kind of date, basically. And I'm, I'm even ready to move out of the United States just to raise a family. And sure, I'm, I'm sure some people would say, yeah, you're just a sensitive asshole, but then... 
fine, I'm a sensitive asshole. You guys can keep being jerks and assholes that way, but you're just pushing out all the the nice people, basically. And so I guess that's it. That's just all I want to say. Again, a whiny video, a vlogging video, just stuff that's been on my mind. So whatever, thumbs up. I don't care about the thumbs up and sure any of that shit on this channel because this is just a vlogging channel. So I'm not going to even be asking for thumbs up anymore unless it's a video I work really hard on like my American holiday type videos and that kind of stuff. So if I work hard on that, I will ask you guys to do thumbs up and stuff. But you can also subscribe, subscribe if you want to see any of these types of videos, completely random videos, vlogs, or just American related stuff. So yeah, that's it. See you guys later.